Hey Vapors, happy Halloween and welcome back to my channel. It's the end of the month so it's time to pick my monthly favorites. Alright guys, yes, today is October 31st. Happy Halloween. I hope everyone's having a fun and safe Halloween. I am going to be picking my favorites for the month of October. So if you're new here, I look back on the month of videos that I made and I tell you guys what I'm still loving from the month of everything that I looked at. So let's just get to it super easy this month. I like, I have an e-liquid that literally beat out everybody this month. So let me start with my favorite device of the month. Like a, I have three. I have my top three from October. So the first one, and you may know this if you follow me on social media, I posted a lot about it this month. The Vapresso Tarot Nano is my favorite, especially in this rainbow color. It's so pretty and I just love it. It's a cute little handheld compact device and it became my one of my go-to's on my vacation this month as well and my road trip companion and everything and I really like the way this vapes and I have Hoot Nut in it by Bonsai Vapor which actually isn't part of my October favorites but it's just my one of my fall favorites that I've been enjoying and it's a banana nut bread you can get it for 20% off if you use my code TIA20 on Bonsai Vapor's website or 20% off any e-liquid on Bonsai Vapor's website using that code as well but Go try this because it's so good. That looks scary or dumb. My second favorite device that I looked at and super surprisingly, and I even took this out with me on a trip and I, I like, I don't know why I gravitated towards it, but I did, is Stick X8 by Smoke or Smock, however you want to say it, I don't give a fuck. Um, it's the X Baby tank on here and I don't know why, but like it just was so perfect, it, like slipped right in my purse. I had a couple of my favorite devices out of commission, like my all time favorites. So this like came in handy and I have, birthday bash by the cakery e-liquid in here which also again is not one of my October favorites just one of my favorites in general it's a birthday cake flavor but it's gonna have to move over because your girl's making the birthday cake flavor of her very own well bonsai's making it for me but that's beside the point but this I don't know it's like so powerful and compact and usually these tanks I'm like no thank you but I'm used to it now like I can I can do it kind of like sometimes I get overly excited and think I'm like can handle it and <laughs> no clouds bitch and my third and last favorite device for the month of October that I looked at is also surprisingly <laughs> Going to the Smoke or Smock Priv V8, I do like it. Again, it's another compact handheld one, but this takes an external 18650 battery, which I like that. And the style of this just adds like a little personal flair. Personally, probably prefer this in a different combo, but someone made the comment that it kind of looks like Iron Man colors. Again, it has a TFV tank on it, and these things blow clouds and force feed you the vapor, but I'm getting used to it, so I've really enjoyed it. And I have in here, Oh, this is, okay, so this is the e-liquid of the month. This literally, this e-liquid beat out these three, because I tried three flavors from this line, I don't know if they have any more, um, beat out all of, all of the other e-liquid that I tried this month. So these three beat out every, like, I would pick the three from this line as my favorites versus any of the other lines I looked at in October. Binge Vapors. Oh my gosh, they made three flavors that I tried and two of them are already gone. This one I'm like saving for last because it's so stinking good. And this is Indulgence and it's a strawberry chewy candy flavor and I really like strawberry vapes. It's one of my favorite fruit vapes. They did so good. It's such a good candy flavor without being overly sweet, but being sweet enough to satisfy somebody with a sweet tooth that would wake the dead. So easy peasy, those are my favorites for the month of October. It was super easy to pick, especially with the e-liquid. But I also like to mention my favorite device of all time in my favorites videos, just in case it changes, which it officially has. So if you hadn't known, like jump on the train, the, almost said Cupti, that was my favorite before this one, the Penguin SE is my new favorite in pink OMG. I love this thing. And in here right now I have this bottle's actually empty because I have the last of this in here, which is Chikora. This is just one of my all time favorites. Again, not a favorite from October, but it's like a cinnamon horchata and it's so stinking good. It's been my favorite for a year. One of my favorites for years. And the penguin. I just love this all in one device and it took my love away from the cup tea. And I heard there's another version sort of coming out like this one. Out. 
So that is my favorites for the month of October. Let me know down in the comments below what your favorites are for this month. Let me know if you're doing anything fun for Halloween. What are you guys doing? I'm actually just going to sit at home and I'm going to wash this off my face. Sit in my Pikachu onesie with my husband in his Chewbacca onesie. We're probably going to watch Hocus Pocus first and then some more American Horror Story Roanoke. We're watching that on Netflix. We have binged that entire season. I've watched a couple of them by myself but got too scared with some of them and was like, Doug, we have to watch them with me. And so I made him watch it one through all of them. And so we're on Roanoke right now. And it's so spooky. It's perfect for Halloween. And I'll be eating little pieces of candy from the Halloween candy bag that my grandma gives me. I have 16 cousins and every year she gives all of the grandkids a little bag of candy because all of us now are too grown to go trick-or-treating but it's been like that every year since we were little like everyone gets a bag of candy with their name on it it's like a little spooky bag with like the bomb candy my grandma hooks it up and that is what I wait for on Halloween <laughs> since I don't go trick-or-treating and we don't get any trick-or-treaters here I live out in the middle of the woods in the middle of nowhere so ain't no kids gonna trick-or-treat at my house and if I heard a knock on the door on Halloween I probably wouldn't answer now another thing I had been adding to my monthly favorites video is when an e-liquid company sends me one e-liquid flavor to try I want to sample it here to tell you guys about it but not make an entire video for one flavor and I don't know anything about this company so I'm gonna add an annotation in here somewhere with like the information about this e-liquid I'm gonna do a blind taste test. It is Cobra G Sierra Maestra, Maestra, Sierra Maestra, and we'll see if I'm even close. It smells like tobacco, oh no. Why does it smell like tobacco? It smells like a baked good and tobacco. That's 100% a tobacco vape, like a sweet tobacco. My RDA <coughs> is not working, <coughs> but I can tell that's tobacco. Anyways, that's it for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, give it a thumbs up and feel free to subscribe to this channel for more videos. Check the description box below for important links like where to get my favorite things like e-liquids, mods, etc. You can follow me on almost any social media site like Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, or Snapchat. All those social media links will be below. I also started a Patreon account where I am doing monthly vape-related rewards over there, so if that's something you're interested in, I'll leave that link below as well. And one more thing before you go, if vaping is something you're passionate about, please join Kasa.org and learn how you can fight for your right to vape. So as always, I'm Tia, and thank you so much for watching.